everybody, Kurt with Strange Beacons here and I'm coming to you today with a very short video to show off a brand new app that I downloaded from the Apple App Store onto my iPad. And what we have here is a great little application that gives you the old phone freaking blue box, the green box, the red box, and a whole bunch of other things that you can use for old school phone freaking fun. Um, as I have explained, I think in the past and some of the other videos that I've put out about about uh, phone freaking, there's not a whole lot that you can actually do these days, especially with MF style tones, because everything on modern phones is DTMF instead of multi frequency. It's dual tone multi frequency, but these things exist because a lot of people like me really just are nostalgic for the old school phone systems that were around. I know I used to play on them when I was a kid and got really interested when I found out about phone freaking many years later. And uh, the only thing really that's left that you can do is to find something like Project MF, which actually has their own private phone server that simulates an old school um, phone system with its trunk and all of that that you can actually go on to and use a blue box to seize the trunk and enter in the tones and make it do all kinds of really cool stuff. Anyway, I thought I'd give a quick demonstration of this and pardon the shakiness and out of focus video because I'm having to hold up my phone, ironically, to uh, videotape this, but I thought I'd give you a really quick demonstration about what some of this does and what it sounds like. So. The thing that we're looking at now is the blue box, and it's the standard, uh, all the standard blue box features, you know, the keypad. And you've got the other standard keys that come with it, the 2600 tone. You've got the uh, key pulse tone. And you've got the, you know, stop tone, the ST button. And you can use all of those when you're, um, you know, setting up a sequence to seize a trunk with. So it's really handy and it's nice and fresh. The keys work really well on it. Then there's the infamous red box, which um, phone freakers invented using the same sort of tonal um, tonal send functions to actually trick a phone payphone into thinking that you had deposited a nickel, dime, or a quarter. And the, the tones for that are as follows. One for a nickel two for a dime, and three for a quarter. And they also down here have uh, 10 pence and 50 pence, which are obviously the UK equivalent for their phones. And let's see over here, the green box, it uh, has a coin collect, coin collect, coin return, ring back in a 2600 tone. So I believe what it was is that you could trick the pay phone in to actually, for instance, on coin return, trick it into giving you money back that you actually did not put in there so it's kind of kind of interesting there's a standard touch tone pad here for DTMF and let's see what else do we have information tones this one's pretty cool it's got a listing here for international no circuit no circuit local reorder reorder local intercept ineffective and vacant circuit and I'll play all of these just through a little bit here everybody recognizes that who's ever dialed the wrong number or had a circuit that was busy and let's see miscellaneous tones this one's pretty cool this gives you old standard um, telephone uh, tonal systems like a busy signal A reorder tone, a ring back, a standard dial tone, dial tone special, and off hook. That one used to drive me crazy when I was a kid. You'd, you know, you'd leave the phone off the hook, and all of a sudden, boom! You'd hear that blaring after you're about ten feet away, and you're like, "What the heck?" A uh, bad code siren. 
low tone, high tone, sprint tone, and tassy. Uh, a lot of other stuff in here, some international stuff for Australia, Europe, France, Ireland, Israel, Mexico, New Zealand, and the UK. And let's see what else do we have here. Tone detection. Um, I think this would be similar to like the Wolfie Solutions DTMF decoder that I have. It'll actually, you can see I'm speaking my voice in here. You can see the uh, little tones that are actually starting to pop up. So you could use this for a DTMF decoder. And so you have preferences section. You've got a help section here. It tells you what the blue box, green box, red box, touch tone, and information tones are all about. So anyway, uh, you know, this uh, is a really cool little app, and I'm looking forward to um, using this to uh, play around with Project MF again. So I get around to it, I will try to create another video and use this in conjunction with the phone that I'm recording this with and see if I can show you a little bit more about the fun that you can have. Anyway, thanks for watching.